42 year old tradition returning to Ocean Beach this morning, but a recent spike in crime has a lot of families worried. Fox Eyes Elizabeth Alvarez live along Newport Avenue where a very unique Christmas tree just arrived. Elizabeth, good morning. Hey, good morning, you guys. Yeah, the city of Ocean Beach is ready to ring in this holiday season in true OB fashion. I mean, take a look. The community Christmas tree has just arrived and it is being set up. And you should have heard the cheers, right? The cheers. We've got members of the community out here. We also have San Diego Police Department officers here. And what a sight to see. Uh, I mean, this tree, by the way, stands 60 feet tall. I was told it's actually taller than the one that they put up last year. And when we say it's a community Christmas tree, indeed it is a community Christmas tree. This tree came from a resident over off of Homer and Rosecrans in the Midway District. It was just chopped down this morning. It was on the side of the yard here. Someone who knows all about this tradition is Corey. He is president of the OB Town Council. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Good morning. Good morning. I feel like singing that song, Oh Christmas Tree. Yes. Oh, um, how exciting is this for the Ocean Beach community? So exciting. I mean, this is a tradition that's going on 40 plus years. Um, we've been pulling it locally for the past couple of decades now. And it's just kind of marks the beginning of the holiday season in OB, which across the city, but especially here in our neighborhood, is a really special time uh, for our neighbors. and in this town, so it's an exciting day. It is an exciting day, and for a lot of people who have never really seen the process happen, I mean, this tree got a police escort, right? Uh, coming from that resident uh, residence down in the Midway area came. It ha it's still connected to a crane, right? It is, it is, yep, and we, that'll be released in the next couple of minutes here, and then, uh, you know, one thing that's famous about the Obi tree is that it always has a little bit of a lean to it. Yeah. We even have a beer named after it, the Crooked Tree IPA, so so as soon as that part of the crane is released, we'll see which way the tree leans. That's always an exciting moment as well. Right, always so unique and so talked about, right? And what was interesting too, because I had never seen it that close up, there's a yeah. manhole in the sand. Now, do you know if that was built because of this back in the 80s? It was, yes. There's a manhole in the sand. It goes down about six feet deep. Uh, every year we have to go fishing under the sand to find it again, kind of X marks the spot. And yeah, yeah, that was put into the sand specifically for this project. Um, really, really exciting. Yeah, and this again was a donated tree, right? Uh, what can you tell us about where the tree came from? Yeah, so every year we kind of put a call out to residents if folks have trees on their property, um, especially here on the peninsula, so it's easy to move. And we're looking for trees that are already posing a threat to the property, their root systems pulling up the sidewalk, a tree that's slated to already come down so that we're not killing trees that are healthy live trees. Um, but this tree was ready to come down. Uh, the person who donated it has lived here on the peninsula their whole life and been in their house for the past 20 years and was really excited to see their tree featured as the OB tree this year. So awesome. Thank you, Corey. It yeah. is a very special time right now. Again, the kickoff of the holiday season here in Ocean Beach. They're going to spend the day decorating uh, this tree today. Pretty much all day is what Corey was saying. All in anticipation, of course, of the OB Holiday Parade, which is Saturday. That kicks off at 5 p.m. And for those who are concerned about, you know, all of the recent stories that we've been covering regarding the, the crime and some of the, the attacks on people uh, by some of the homeless who to, you know, gather here in Ocean Beach. Well, police, we did get a statement from Lieutenant Adam Sharkey, who says they do have a security plan in place to ensure the safety of all who participate. We are live this morning in Ocean Beach. What do you think, Shali and Raul? I think you have a fine singing voice, and we will be putting that to good use in the next couple of weeks. I completely Elizabeth, <laughs> what he said. Yes.